you can download Zingo Wallet with this link. So once you click on the link and the description button below, you are going to be redirected to Zingo Wallet. Then you cannot click on install. So as you can see, another way of downloading is that you can just search for Zingo. Yeah, search for Zingo, then use this exclamation mark. Then you click on the search button. So this is um, Zingo right here. Yeah, this is Zingo right here. Then you can now click on Zingo. Then you can now install. So I have Zingo installing already. So let's see as this downloads. Since I'm done downloading Zingo Wallet or my Zing, so my Zingo Wallet is right here. Then, in this place, you can actually restore your wallet if you have an existing Zingo Wallet account. So, if you don't have an existing Zingo Wallet account, if you're a new user, you can just click here. I'm going to click on the Create New Wallet button. So, click on the Create New Wallet button here. Then, you are going to have some seed phrases generated. Yeah. These are your seed phrase right here. Let me show you what your seed phrase are. These are your seed phrases right here. So these are your seed phrases. Then you are going to click on tab to copy. Click on the tab to copy icon. Click on the tab to copy icon. And ensure you save your seed phrase and save it in where nobody will have access to your seed phrase. Then click on I have saved seed phrase then you are good to go if you want to receive some zcash token in your zingo wallet click on the receive button option here then um, copy your wallet address copy your shaded wallet address this is a shaded wallet address right here then you click on the tab to copy button click on the tab to copy button then just click on the tab to copy then you are good send this some zcash token to my zingo i'm going to paste in my zingo wallet address here then um i can see the amount of zing out of zing around 0 0.1 0 0.2 0 0.3 then I can include in the amount that I'm going to make use of the memo here. I make use of my memo. So I'm going to type in the memo, the subject of the memo right here. Then I'm going to type in the message inside this text here. So let's say um, Zingo testing. Then I'm going to say Zingo test transaction. Then I'm going to click on the send icon. So this is the send icon right here. So you click on the send icon. Then I'm going to send this. Then you can see the privacy is always I. The privacy is always I. In Zcash, so this is very very cool. Then you click on send. You click on send. You can see the transaction is in progress. You can see transaction has been sent. Let's confirm the deposit of Zcash token on Zingo. You can see. So I'm gonna click on this option right here then you can see you can see i have my zcash tokens deposited you can see this so these are my zcash tokens you can also see the memo and these are the memo in my zingo wallet that
say you want to send some zcash tokens out of zingo wallet to other wallet so you click on um, the send button icon right here then um, click on send you have to paste in your wallet address here the wallet address in which you want to send your tokens to then you're going to paste in the amount of um, zcash token you want to send right here then you're going to click on the send option right here so i'm pasting this zcash wallet address from my y wallet then let's say i want to send um 0.0135 then i can include the memo right here this is where i'm going to include the memo in this box so i'm gonna say zingo incoming incoming transaction to extend i'm going to click on the send button right here then um, i'll say send then you can now confirm then you click on the confirm option right here then you can see the transaction is computing so the transaction is computing 25 percent 50% right now, 75% then 100% right now you can see we have um, transaction broadcasted successfully you can also fund your Z sampling wallet click here so once you click here then um, you click on the tab to copy I'm going to copy this and paste on my address, my Y wallet address. Then I'm going to paste my Zingo wallet address here. Then let's say I want to send in um, 0 0.1 0 .1 or 0 0.3. So then I can just click on the send icon right Click on the send icon right here. Then I click on send. Then um, I'll click on the. You can see the privacy is always right. Then I'm gonna click on send here. Yeah, payment in progress. Payment successful. I'm going to find my transport wallet address too. So I'll click on this icon right here on the transport button. Click on transport. Then I'm going to click on the tab to copy. Even though this is not really um, very secured due to low privacy, then I click on tab to copy. Then I'm going to paste this wallet address on my Y wallet from Zingo. You can see the privacy is quite low due to the transparency. Then I'll click on send. Fully. Click on my font pool, so I'm going to click on this icon right here to get my orchard and all that details. Then I'm going to click on font pools here. Then, um, you, as you can see, this is my Hushard balance. I have my Hushard balance right here. Then um, I have the spendable balance. This is this this the, the sampling balance and you have the spendable balance here then this is the transparent balance too